I want to respond to your question concerning God's interest in, in governance. There are many people that have been asking me questions about what is God's opinion? Does God care who rules? And this time around, I want to particularly uh, explain God's interest in East Africa. Now, there are those who want to know whether God is interested in Uganda and uh, in, the, in the, the upcoming elections. Just like I, I said and I wrote to Tanzanians concerning uh, His Excellency Magufuli, and, uh, and many Tanzanians received the message of God. I may not know how Ugandans may perceive this, but I want to say this, that many times God's interest in a person is many times different from majority of the people. You remember in Israel, God wanted Samuel to keep ruling, but Israelites wanted King Saul. And therefore God had to give in and allow them to have King Saul. But in the case of Uganda, I see that God still has interest in His Excellence President Museven. I may not know how the majority of people want it because I'm not a Ugandan myself. I don't stay in Uganda. But I want to tell the Ugandans this, that God has interest in President Museven, not primarily because of Ugandans, but because of East Africans and because of Africans and all the black people living all over the world. So there is a great possibility that by the power of God, while Bobby Wine and the rest of the people are very good people, I, I am seeing a possibility where God may not give them a chance to rule in Uganda at the moment. At the moment in the next coming election, President Yugoeli Kagutam 7 is likely to continue ruling not because many Ugandans may love the idea, but because Ugandans must understand that Uganda is not without a God. There is a God who has interest in President M7, not just for Ugandans, but for all of us as Africans. And therefore, when that the right time for the rest of the people come, God will have them rule, he will have them in power. Even concerning Kenya, if Kenya was like Tanzania or Uganda, we could speak many things openly. But we already know who is not going to be president of Kenya. We already know who shall be president of Kenya. But we might not say because Kenyans don't even respect men of God, they can even kill you anytime. They are not like Tanzanians. And therefore, we are just watching and waiting, but we know what will happen. There are several things that are going on in Kenya, but they don't matter. BBI or whatever them they call them, still what God wants will come to pass.